Have you been wanting to explore countries by food and seen Peru's Eat to Explore kit? Or Eat to Explore's Peru kit? Well, in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing Eat to Explore's Peru box. Let's see what's inside. So coming out, we got, we got some brassa mix, which is something that we're going to be using in our first dish. We got a bunch of recipes for awesome dishes. We got a little Eat to Explore Peru guide kit that has a bunch of learning curriculum in it. We have, we have an egg slicer. We have a sauce, some seasoning mixes, and a Peru sticker and pin. Let's get started. Each Eat to Explore kit comes with its very own tool. This one is an egg slicer. Here's how to use it. You open the egg slicer and you place a boiled egg in it, a peeled one. Next, you press down on it and you take your slices. Then you lift it up and you separate the slices. That's so cool, isn't it? Let's get started making our first dish. Let's get started by reading our recipe. As you can see, we have a nice shopping list and some stuff from our basic pantry. We also have two things that come in the kit and that's the brasa mix and the aja verde mix. So let's get started with marinating the chicken. The chicken has to marinate overnight or at least two hours, so we're gonna be doing the two hour option. To get started by marinating the chicken, you're gonna to wanna to start by opening up your chicken and patting it dry. To begin marinating your chicken, get out a cutting board and place down two connected paper towels. Get another two to pat the chicken dry. Open up your chicken and begin placing it on the paper towels. Next, once your chicken is placed on the tower, towel, grab your two paper towels and begin patting them dry. Once the chicken is dry, you can flip it over and make sure it's equally dry on the other side. Putting the paper towel down makes it so you don't have to do it twice. To make our marination, we have to mix olive oil and brasa mix in a Ziploc bag. Tablespoons of your olive oil in. I'm using half tablespoon because my tablespoon has already been used today. And pour your brasa mix inside the bag. As you can see, the olive oil will float to the top. Next, one by one, place your chickens in the bag. and coat the chickens very well. Then place them in the refrigerator for two hours. Oh no. <laughs> well, I mean, make sure it is 100% sealed. Yeah. 